Yo, Ryan, it's the Kings. We need your help. We need to deliver drive to the winner of our 2,000 subscriber contest. There's 100,000 streets in this city. That's fine, man. We only need you to take us to one. You give me a time and a place. I give you a five-minute window. Anything happens in that five minutes, and I'm yours. Anything happens the minute I decide that, and you're on your own. Do you understand? Sure. How's 8.30? be able to reach me on this phone again. What? Yo, what's up, Ryan, my guy? Ryan. Sorry about the ski mask, but you know how it is. We just hit 2K. We're kind of celebrities now. I need you to take us to the winner of the Subscribe for Drive contest. You know that movie you were in? Let's go. Well, Russ, we finally did it. 2K subscribers, and we're on our way to deliver this to the winner. It's a wonderful release, my favorite of the year. It had a great hard box. Feel that box. You hear that? The hardback book, I feel like, is the best part of this. Look at these cards. They're great. Every actor is present. You got Ryan, you, yourself, you're here. See that? Great stuff, great stuff, great release. Do you remember that movie you directed that no one saw? It was basically a ripoff of every Nicholas Refnan. Nick, Nick, what's the guy's name? Nicholas Refnan. Is it challenging getting into character as a bland white man in every movie, or does that just come naturally? What's it like starring in the new Barbie movie? Hey Ryan, do you find it ironic that the film's title was Only God Forgives when every human cannot forgive you for that trash? Ides of March, where he plays George Clooney's political advisor. He was every bit as interesting as that synopsis sounds. La La Land, we're going to the La La Land. I saw that Half Nelson movie where he's a crackhead teacher. He was still just a bland, white, good-looking guy, even That's as it. a crackhead. <laughs> even as a crackhead, Ryan, you're <laughs> fucking hot. Why do you think they cast Ryan as Ken? Because he's this generation's Marlon Brando? Who, a guy that doesn't give a fuck about anything, shows up on set late, doesn't know the lines? Whoa! Right, 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 slow down, slow down. Slow down, slow down. We need love now. We don't need crazy or stupid. Listen, Mr. Gosling, sir, the notebook is phenomenal. I love it. Great. You know that 20 minutes you were in Place Beyond the Pines? I loved it. What? Brian, the gray man. It was awesome. I don't care what anyone said. I don't care that it debuted on Netflix. It was great. Please, just slow it down. Holy shit, Ryan, it's a fucking helicopter, right, bro. Right, right. Slow down. For real, dude, slow down, slow down. Slow the fuck down. You know what? Fuck it, man. We are 4K kings. I'm not holding back anymore. Slow down. La La Land was a shameful ripoff of Umbrellas of Sherbu, and you know it. You know it. You know it. Thanks a lot for hanging up on me earlier, too, Ryan. Real classy. You're not getting a five star for this Uber ride. Yeah, just like your movies. No five stars. Just like Matt explaining the joke. Why are we pulling into a parking garage? Dude, what are we doing? Why are you stopping? Dude, we should have just mailed it. I think you're right.